Hey, as Nation, thank you for checking out this video, guys. Welcome back to a brand new vlog. Now, two things quickly before I start today's vlog. First thing, the headband. My hair is so long, I have no wax. I'm rocking a headband. Don't judge me on that one. Second thing, I promise you there will be no golf in this vlog. This is a 100% no golf vlog. I'm making in today's big deal that there is going to be no golf at all in today's video. We're going to start today's video really, really simple. We're going to start on a couple of things on the club sport as we slowly get ready to get this thing to be put up on the market to be sold. It is a absolute beautiful amazing day here in my local city of Mandra. We have literally had nothing but thunderstorms for the last three weeks. My arm is already tired and I've only been holding this camera for a minute. It shows you how much I don't vlog anymore. But look let's jump straight into today's video. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day and let's just get into it. Easily the most frustrating thing about having a lowered car. If we could all take a really quick moment just to really appreciate how good Post Malone's Beer Bongs and Bentley's album is, that would be amazing. I've been working on this thing for about an hour now. I didn't really get that far, but one thing that I really noticed that was quite surprising was that the club got a rev restriction put on the motor or the ECU when one of the turbos was starting to seize. The weird thing is though is that I just tested that turbo and that turbo is perfectly fine which so it means I could actually pull the rev restriction on. I'm probably going to have to take down the mechanics and get them to go over the whole motor and make sure before we pull the rev restriction off. This could get back to where it was before. And also, what was causing it to seize, you know? I know there's a bit of crap around the turbo, but was, was that it? But look, we're creeping up to lunchtime. I'm getting a little bit nibblish. So I need to get some appropriate tools to keep working on this because the tools I have, I can't do what I need to do. So I'll have to do that a little bit later. There's something else I want to show you guys while I'm here. Every single morning, I have to go to work. I have to go in the Pulsar. Because obviously, I don't really drive the clubby. And it, it, it literally is just an ice box on wheels. But look, enough talking. Let's go get some food. I don't know what I'm feeling. I got some sort of peckish for donuts, but let's get a feed, eh? You wanna go get some food? No. Why not? Too bad. Too bad. Come on, let's go. Did you do this to the club sport? No, you did this. No, you. You did this. No, you. You got it? No. no. Got it now. <laughs> got it. Got it? Yeah. Cool. I will admit one thing is, I find tees everywhere like I found like three in the club sports boot and I don't remember ever putting them in there I'm just getting in a breeze car there's a random golf tee Just quickly on a side note as well, if my vlogging skills or editing isn't really up to scratch, let me know down in the comments below. It's been so long since I've done any vlogging whatsoever. Try not to judge me too harshly. We all know how little I vlog. I want to get back into vlogging, but I always just don't have ideas of what to film. You gonna go to basket, miss? Yeah, go on. All yours. You got that under control? Wait, which one did you get? Red. Show me. Can you show me? Why not? I'll put it back. Well, if it's full, go to the checkout. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Go, check out. That's just lazy. Uh, so we've pretty much done everything we need to do today. All we did was end up buying some really terrible food, which I'll eat a little bit later. The other thing I want to do while I'm down here is I want to try to get... Obviously, coming into winter, it's getting really, really cold. And let's be brutally honest with you, I haven't really updated any of my shoes or my jackets in almost a year. So I want to get a new pair of shoes, new jacket or something. Just freshen up the style. Like, I think it's about six months old now. It's a little bit outdated. So if we can get a new jacket, new shoes, new pants, just something to freshen it up a bit, you know? So I feel like something like this. What's this? 80 bucks, that's so cheap. Like a nice, good, warm jacket. See, I don't mind the idea of having a long jacket. This one's just a, too short for me, but. 
It makes you look so long. It does, doesn't it? I think this is something you'd have to wear with pants. Oh yeah. Like, I mean, obviously, I don't normally wear shorts as it is anyway, but I wish there was another button. Like, I feel like it needs one more button, like just up here. I feel like it's just that little bit too low. Hmm. You just see, think? I prefer this one because this. See, this is the one I like the most because it's got that big collar. And it's not too long, so something like, I reckon something easily, something like this, like... That's the look. That's the look this winter for your ass boy. So how much is this? Did you look? 120. 120. I think all we would need is some new shoes, because these things are just, they're just too worn out now. Like, because they're my like casual Jordans. So for a lot of you guys that know me, I'm Jordans. I always buy Nike Air Jordans. That's just the brand that I always wear. There's only one shop here in Mandra that actually sells Jordans and that's Foot Locker. And being a, a smaller sort of Foot Locker, they don't have like the biggest range. I normally get most of my shoes from Perth. Man, but I will admit that I love that last jacket. I'm definitely gonna be getting that when I get, uh, when I get time to get it. And I really, really, really enjoyed vlogging again, honestly. It's been very, like vlogging's like, once you get back into it, you're back into it, but getting back into it is like the hardest thing. But no, I really, really enjoyed it. Look, we're gonna go home, I'm gonna cook up these wings and show you how good these things look, taste, everything. They're 10 bucks, and they're amazing. But we're gonna whip on home. Get a feed, pick up Adam, and uh, we're gonna be jumping into the live stream tonight. I can't wait for tonight's live stream. Shout everyone out in the stream in another vlog. But look, too much jabbering on. Let's get home and get fed. So like, straight up, like I'm like the worst influence when it comes to what food I eat. I'm a terrible eater. So what do we got here? We got some nice donuts. Come on, don't be hating on me. Got some chocolate. Got some sour lollies. Got my wings and these things here. Like honestly, I don't know if you guys got them in America or UK, but here in Australia you can get this wood. It's like ten bucks, and it's it's a kilo of wings. And they are actually really, really nice. We'll whip these up and I'll show you. And trust me, take my word for it, but don't follow my influence of my eating, okay? It's, it's not healthy. and you, you, it's, it's not healthy. Unless you play golf a lot, it's not healthy. By no means am I a chef either, okay? I don't really cook ever, so this is about much effort. Honestly, putting on the alfoil was too much effort for my own life. Brie would have told me off for not doing that, to be honest. We'll quickly whip those up, and then I'll show you how delicious they look when they come out. All right, let's see how it tastes, eh? Jeez, you think they just come out of an oven or something? They're hot. But in all seriousness, I'm not gonna sit here and just watch you, get you guys watch me eat wings. So I'm gonna smash these down. We're gonna continue this sort of comeback style vlog. Well, look, don't get me wrong. It's uh, three o'clock in the afternoon. We all know that my stream started at six o'clock my local time. But you know, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling excited. I want to jump into a live. So I'm gonna cut my vlog a little bit short today because I'm gonna jump into a live stream. But that also means who are we shouting out tonight? Well, look, I don't know if you're going to be able to tell this, but I'm actually wearing different clothes from what you guys would have just seen, and that's because it's actually a different day. I couldn't shout out the stream because I got banned on YouTube again. I've been banned on YouTube twice in the last week, but tonight was the night that I got my, my channel back. Special shout out to Mitch Games 24 7 He's raided me a couple of times over the last couple of days. Thank you very much, Mitch. You appreciate it, bro. Thank you so much. Thank you so much to every single one of you guys as we're slowly creeping up towards 18,000 subscribers. It's an amazing achievement by all of you guys. You guys have to take the credit for it. 
for it. And if you did enjoy today's video, don't forget to leave a big fat thumbs up on it, guys. Thank you so much to everyone that liked, subscribed, and just everything on today's video. It feels great to be vlogging. Again, I really want to try to get back into vlogging, but it's just such a mental thing to get back into it. Thank you very much to every single one of you guys. Thank you very much, truly, from the bottom of my heart. Guys, have a great one. I'll see you guys around, or I don't know. I can't think of a great outro, guys. <laughs> see you later, guys.